we're looking forward to going playing a great game at uh, Grand Valley. We uh, are uh, tr treating this as a, a great opportunity for us to go on the road and go compete. And we uh, we're traveling big time for these guys and, and uh, playing a big time opponent. And we're looking forward to uh, getting things done. Sure. Um, you probably mentioned this after last game on Thursday. What was it like to see him back out on the field and knowing things why and kind of getting that out of the way and now just focus on the rest of the season? Oh, I shoot. It, it was wonderful having um, the ability to see the stands uh, there, people in the stands and, and being engaged with it. But it, it was really, it, it was really, um, I don't know, it's hard to put in words, but it was really surreal for me to see those kids go out and go compete and go play and get all the things done that they needed to. And so I thought that um, our, our kids played a, a heck of a ball game. It was, uh, it was great. It was competitive. It was fun to see our guys go make plays and their opponent go make plays. I mean, that's what you play college football, playing games like that. And, uh, you know, we came a little short. I, I think I could have done a lot better job of coaching, that's for sure. I, I know there was some things that um, I, I need to work on. And, and uh, it's so I, I'm, I'm anxious to go and, and um, learn from my mistakes. What do you take away from the game where you only give up 12 points and you still don't come up Well, I, th I think what we, we, we're going to take away from this is that I, I, I thought our defense played well. We gave them a short field on th three drives in the third quarter, and then in the fourth, we, we muffed a kickoff. And, and uh, uh, so we, we went to our code blue, and, and our guys responded and, and, and held them to a field goal to give us a chance. And so I think that uh, what I can take away, our, ke our kids kept fighting. They have great character, great work ethic. And um, they, they showed that because we, we faced a lot of adversity in the game. We, you know, our starting quarterback went down and, and uh, we had some guys come in and step up on it. And uh, we lost our starting linebacker and a guy that was on starter on the all special teams within a matter of about four minutes, it seemed like. And so our, our kids responded and, and it was nice to see them go compete. And, and uh, I'm, I'm looking forward to uh, taking what we learned and apply it to our body of work as we go through our season. Yeah, and you start off right off the bat with tough opponents, another tough opponent this week. What are the benefits to that to start the season off? I know Frank has said you don't have to do that, but what are the benefits to start off like that moving forward? Well, I, I really think the benefits are that uh, we want to be compared to the very best in the country, and we want to go and compete against the very best in the country. And when you can play at Commerce and then go on the road and play at Grand Valley, and and, and have that in, in understanding that's what it is, that you're gonna go and, and have a chance to go and compete and go show what you're made of. I think it only helps you down in, in November and it only gonna help show your resume as we go through that. So I, I think that we're gonna be battle te tested as we go through and hopefully we learn from our mistakes and ho hopefully we can correct those things. It was, uh, they're playing Ed Edinburgh, and uh, I think Edinburgh has some COVID issues. Anything else? Coach, what are you most excited about taking the road trip this time for 29 years? Well, I think that uh, what I, I like getting away. I like being with our players. I like being with our coaches. I think um, that, that gets me excited because we're all together and, and be able to control the environment. I think the other great thing is that we're, we're going to play a, a top-notch team, and, and I like to go coach in those games. I like to be able to see our guys compete against the very best. And so all those are the factors they say, God, we, we get to go do this, and, and what an opportunity it is for us to do that. What's your biggest focus heading up against uh, a top-15 team that you still have yet to see any film on for this year? Well, I, I, I know they probably got film on us, and, and – um, we don't have any film on them, so we're going kind of in blind about what their personnel looks like and uh, what their ideas or philosophies are. But 
the reality of this thing is uh, we got to go play. We got to go play 60 minutes. We got to adjust, and our players got to go play fast. They got to enjoy the environment and go play as hard as they can. And so, those are the things that I'm I'm looking forward to seeing. Good. Thanks. Go pack.